Good morning, welcome to the Daily Office, <clears throat> and thank you for joining me. This is Morning Prayer for Easter Friday, April the 21st. The scripture for this service, Psalms, Psalm 136, and Daniel chapter 12, verses 1 through 4 and 13. And now, please join me in singing the first verse of The Strife is O'er. Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. The strife is o'er, the battle done. The victory of life is won. This song of triumph has begun. Alleluia, 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 Alleluia. Open my lips, my mouth shall declare your praise. Hallelujah! Oh, give thanks to the Most High, for God is good. God's mercy endures forever. Hallelujah! Psalm 136, and please recite it with me. Hallelujah! Oh, give thanks to the Most High, for God is good, and God's mercy endures forever. Oh, give thanks to the God of gods, for God's mercy endures forever. Oh, give thanks to the Most High of the high, for God's mercy endures forever. Who alone does great wonders, for God's mercy endures forever. Whose wisdom made the heavens, for God's mercy endures forever. Who stretched out the earth above the waters, for God's mercy endures forever. Who made great lights, for God's mercy endures forever. The sun to rule by day, for God's mercy endures forever. The moon and the stars to rule by night, for God's mercy endures forever. Who smote Egypt in their firstborn, for God's mercy endures forever. And brought out Israel from among them, for God's mercy endures forever. With a strong hand and with a stretched out arm, for God's mercy endures forever. Who divided the Red Sea into parts, for God's mercy endures forever and made Israel to pass through the midst of it, for God's mercy endures forever. But threw Pharaoh and his army into the Red Sea, for God's mercy endures forever. Who led the people through the wilderness, for God's mercy endures forever. Who smote great kings, for God's mercy endures forever. And slew famous kings, for God's mercy endures forever. Sihon, the king of the Amorites, for God's mercy endures forever. And Og, the king of Bashan, for God's mercy endures forever. And gave their land for a heritage, for God's mercy endures forever. A heritage to Israel, God's servant, for God's mercy endures forever. Who remembered us in our lowly estate, for God's mercy endures forever and has redeemed us from our enemies, for God's mercy endures forever. Who gives food to all flesh, for God's mercy endures forever. O oh, give thanks to the God of heaven, for God's mercy endures forever. Glory to you, source of all being, eternal word and Holy Spirit, as in the beginning, so now and forever. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. O oh, give thanks to the Most High, for God is good. God's mercy endures forever. Hallelujah. A reading from the prophet Daniel, chapter 12, beginning at verse 1. At that time, the great prince Michael, who stands beside the sons of your people, will appear. It will be a time of trouble, the like of which has never been seen since the nation came into being. At that time your people will be rescued, all who are found inscribed in the book. And many of those that sleep in the dust of the earth will awake, some to eternal life, others to reproaches, to everlasting abhorrence. 
and the knowledge of all will be radiant like the bright expanse of the sky. And those who lead the many to righteousness will be like the stars forever and ever. But you, Daniel, keep the word secret and seal the book until the time of the end. Many will range far and wide, and knowledge will increase. But you go on to the end. You shall rest and arise to your destiny at the end of the days. Here ends the lesson. We place our hope in you, for with you is mercy and plenteous redemption. Every day we bless you. We praise your name forever and ever, and for all of your intentions. And now, in the words our Savior taught us, we are bold to say, Our beloved, which art in heaven, holy is your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us as we forgive others. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours now and forever. Let us pray. We stand in awe of the works of your hands and thank you for your everlasting love. May you ever protect us and deliver us from all enemies. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Hallelujah. This is the day that God has made. Let us rejoice and be glad in it. Hallelujah. And glory to God whose power working in us can do infinitely more than we can ask or imagine. Glory to God from generation to generation, in the church and in Christ Jesus, now and forever. Amen. Hallelujah.